Hello friends, in the last session we learned about the docker image tagging and we tagged two of the docker images. One is official Ubuntu image and the other one is my first docker image which is the custom image which we built using the docker file. Now friends, in this session let us learn how we can push these tagged docker images to the docker hub registry. So friends, now the first thing which needs to be done to push the docker images to the docker hub registry is to log in to the docker hub account through the command line terminal. So let us go to the docker quick start terminal for this. And now here let us log in to the docker hub account using docker login command. So docker login and then enter. And now here friends we need to enter the docker hub id. So in my case it is it learning. And then here we need to enter the password. So let me enter the password of my IT learning docker hub account here. And now we can see friends we got the message login succeeded. Which means that we have successfully logged into the docker hub account using the command line terminal from our local machine. So now friends let us start pushing the docker images to the docker repositories using the docker push command. So docker push and then we need to pass the docker hub id here which is it learning in my case and then the repository name which is my ubuntu in our case and then finally the image version so let us push the image with version 1.0 and with this friends a docker push command to push the docker image to the docker repository inside the docker hub registry is ready now so now let us press enter to execute this command and here we can see friends that the docker engine has started pushing this docker image to the docker hub registry. And here we can now see friends that this image got pushed successfully to the docker hub's it learning account. So let us verify and examine this image now inside the docker hub registry. So let us go to the browser now. And here let us go to the it learning docker hub account. And now friends let us click on this repository section here. And then let us click on this my Ubuntu repository here. As this is the repository where we pushed our image few minutes back with version 1.0. So now friends here we are inside the my Ubuntu repository page. And here we can see the image tag 1.0 which we pushed few moments back. Also friends we can see the same information related to tags by clicking on the tag section here. Now friends let us go to the docker quick start terminal again and now let us push the image tag 2.0 also for this repository. So friends let us push the image tag as 2.0 now instead of 1.0. And now let us press enter again to execute this command. So friends now the image with tag 2.0 for my Ubuntu repository is pushed successfully to the it learning docker hub account. Now friends let us again examine the my Ubuntu repository inside the docker hub registry. So let us go to the my Ubuntu repository page again. And now here let us refresh this page to see the latest changes. And now here we can see friends that the image tag 2.0 is added to this repository. So friends this is how the docker images are pushed to the docker repositories. Now friends let us push the docker image to our second repository which is my first docker repo repository. So let us go to the docker quick start terminal again. And now this time friends let us change the repository name from my Ubuntu to my first docker repo. And then the image tag or version which we created for this repository is 1.0. So let us give the image version as 1.0 here. And here with this the docker push command is ready now. So let us press enter to execute this command. And here we can see friends that the pushing of the image to the remote my first docker repo repository is started successfully. So friends now this docker image also got pushed successfully inside the docker hub registry. So now let us go to the browser again and let us check the my first docker repo repository this time. So let us go to the repository section here. 
and now this time let us click on this my first docker repo repository and here we can see friends the tag 1.0 which we pushed from our local machine few seconds back so friends with this we have successfully pushed all the three tag docker images to the docker repositories inside the docker hub now friends let us try to pull these docker images but friends before pulling the images let us first delete all the images from this local machine so let us go to the docker quick start terminal again and now here let us first execute the command to delete all the images from this machine so docker rmi and then hyphen f for force delete and then docker images hyphen q and now let us press enter to execute this command and with this friends all the docker images are successfully deleted from this machine so let us verify this by executing the docker images command here so docker images and here we can see friends that now no docker images are present inside this machine so now friends let us execute the docker pull command to pull the images from the docker repositories and let us see whether the images are getting pulled from the docker hub or not so friends let us first pull the image with tag 1.0 from my ubuntu repository so docker pull and then the docker hub registry name which is it learning in my case and then the repository name which is my ubuntu and then the image tag name which is 1.0 and now friends let us press enter to execute this command and here we can see that the image is successfully pulled on this local machine now so let us verify this by executing the docker images command again so docker images and here we can see the pulled image friends similarly friends let us pull the image from my first docker repo repository now so docker pull it learning and then the repository name now this time is my first docker repo and the version is 1.0 and here also we can see friends the image is getting pulled from the docker hub registry and friends this image also got pulled successfully now on this local machine so let us execute the docker images command again so docker images and here we can see friends now the two docker images which are pulled from the it learning docker hub account are present inside our local machine now so friends with this i hope you would have enjoyed this session and now you would have got good understanding on how to push the docker images to the docker repositories inside the docker hub registry so with this friends let us stop this session here and let us continue to learn the remaining concepts related to the docker files from the next session so friends see you in the next session till then take care tata bye bye